السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم uh, Math Grade 5 Today we have simplest form How to write uh, the fraction in simplest form <coughs> How to write the fraction in simplest form What the meaning of simplest form? Simplest form mean, means change the fraction from the difficult form to the easy form This, this is the meaning of simplest form How? How? to do this uh, problem using GCF choose the numerator and numerator and find the prime factors then find GCF then try to divide numerator and numerator as the same GCF you can get uh, the fraction as a simplest form listen to this examples the question here write the fraction in simplest form we have this fraction 6 over 8 the first step take 6 and find the prime factors as you know 6 equal to times 3 then take 8 8 equal 2 times 4 and 4 equal 2 times 2 means 8 equal 2 times 2 times 2 I can write it to exponent 3 now GCF equal the common factors in the low exponent so the common will be 2 but take it in the low exponent means GCF equal 2 then back to the fraction and divide by the GCF here divide by 2 and here divide by 2 now 6 divide by 2 will be 3 8 divided by 2 will be 4. This is the simplest form. This is the simplest form from this fraction. The next example, we have 4 over 16. The first step, take 4 and 16 and find the prime factors. As you know, 4 equal 2 times 2 means 2 exponent 2. 16 equal 4 times 4 and each 4 equal 2 times 2 means 2 repeated 4 times so I can write 2 exponent 4 now find GCF the common factor will be 2 take it in the low exponent 2 exponent 2 means the GCF equal 4 back to the fraction divide by the GCF divide by the GCF so 4 divided by 4 will be will be 1 16 divided by 4 will be 4 in this example we have 21 over 30 take 21 As you know, 21 equal 3 times 7 prime factors. Then take 30. 30 equal, I can write 5 times 6. And 6 equal 2 times 3. So I can write 2 times 3 times 5. Now GCF. The common factor will be 3. The common factor will be 3. So go back to the same fraction. Divide by 3. Divide by 3. 21 divided by 3 will be 7. 30 divided by 3 will be 10. This is the simplest form. This is the simplest form. Now here we have 4 and here we have 11. As you know, 4 equal 2 times 2 means 2 exponent 2. And 11 is prime. 1 times 11. So GCF, no common factors. But as you know, as you know 1 times any number equals the same number. So I can write here 2 exponent 2 times 1. So I can choose 1 as a common factor because, because no common factors here. So GCF is 1 here. So here, 
if you do divide by one divide by one you will get the same fraction that's mean this is the simplest form this is the simplest form here we have 12 over 24 take 12 12 equal 3 times 4 and 4 equal 2 times 2 means 2 exponent 2 and 24 equal 2 times 12 2 times 12 but 12 equal 3 times 2 exponent 2 so here will be 2 exponent 3 times 3 so GCF equal the common factor now 2 take it in the low exponent 2 exponent 2 times 3 2 exponent 2 means 4 4 times 3 will be 12 so the GCF will be 12 now you can write here 12 divide by 12 24 divide by 12 12 divide 12 12 divide by 12 will be 1 and 24 divide by 12 will be 2 this is the simplest form here we have 2 over 5 2 is a prime and 5 is a prime so no GCF means the GCF here equal 1 because 1 is GCF for all numbers so if right here 2 divide by 1 5 divide by 1 you get the same fraction means this is the simplest form this form is the simplest form the last question here we have a divided by 25 as you know 8 equal 2 times 2 times 2 2 exponent 3 and 28 equal 4 times 7 and 4 equal 2 times 2 means 2 exponent 2 so GCF the common is 2 take it in the low exponent 2 exponent 2 means 4 so you can now divide by 4 divide by 4 8 divided by 4 will be 2 and 28 divided by 4 will be 7 so this is the simplest form this is our lesson today thank you for your listening have a nice day assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh